everybody. So we've taken about a month off from opening fan mail just because we had a lot of other projects going on which are coming out in videos soon, probably before this is uploaded actually. But anyway, it's been a while and we've been collecting everything from the P.O. Box, just not opening it yet. And this is what all we have to open today. You guys are so generous. We're gonna open it all. Hi, Cheyenne. Come here. <laughs> That's the most awkward step up. You've never stood in my hands before. Oh, I love you. Okay, you can sit here. What do you you should open that green box. We have had that one forever. Yes. This is the one we picked up first since filming the last opening video. And it's in a Dollar Shave Club box, I think. I'm gonna open this up. Oh, I have to cut around the thing. I think that'll work. You know, that was supposed to be not a hard box to open. Either. There's tape over the little, like, you elastic cut band. The elastic band. Alright, Gia. Holy cow, there's multiple gifts in here. Oh my gosh, what do I open first? We have a sign. It's an S for snake discovery. Here, you take that. And then, oh, there's a piece of paper in here. Okay, I kind of oh. figured that seems like a lot just to be a sign. How do I open this? Not with a knife. Why not? <laughs> How am I supposed to open it without a knife? It's rip. fishing line. Rip it? Yeah. I don't want to rip it. Okay, I'll rip it. Wow, this is the coolest letter ever. How many animals do you have, including fish? No. I have not counted the fish in a while. I think the last time we counted, we had around 85 snakes or 85 reptiles, and then including the fish, probably about 100, I guess. Uh, but what about the dubia roaches and the isopods? I'm not gonna count the dubia roaches and isopods. There's hundreds there of them. There are pets. They're bugs, they're feeders and cleaners. What about cleaners. the rats? Oh yeah, there's a lot of rats too. Okay. What else is in here, Gia? This is a gift for Cheyenne. There's nuts in here, Cheyenne. There's walnuts and hazelnuts and almonds, your favorite. Here, you pick one. You want the almond. Mm. Yay! <laughs> You're gonna make a mess all over the couch with that. But it's tasty. Is that good? Oh, she loves it, Gia. Thank you. Well, there's like a whole sign in here out of, out of foam. There's a little, oh, I see chocolate. I'm gonna get to that later. Oh, cute, there's a bracelet in here. That's really pretty. How do I close it? I think I go, oh, I had it stuck. Cheyenne, help me. Watch Emily struggle to put on a bracelet. I got it! Hooray! Yay! That's really cool how that's put on, actually. It just takes a little bit of hand-eye coordination. There's chocolate in here. Dark chocolate to your deli. Thank you so much for the chocolate. And finally, we have the little box that says enjoy on it. This is a squishy panda ball? I think it looks like a marshmallow, but it's a panda head. I think it's a keychain. Thank you so much, Gia, for all of these gifts. Cheyenne especially is really gonna love these. And I'm gonna love the chocolate, because you can't have it. Next, we have from Rebecca in Utah. Remember, cut away I'm from I'm cutting yourself. away from myself. Look at this. That's the first rule they teach you in Boy Scouts, is cut away from yourself. Is it really? Oh, yeah. A candy, a candy cane. How old is this? <laughs> I just got it recently. <laughs> okay. I love your channel and all your animals, but my favorite animal that you have is candy cane. I love these. These are adorable. You handmade these? You didn't have to give us your favorite Pokemon cards. Come on, Charizard. I see the cards in there, but I'm not going to take them out yet. I'm going to take out... Oh, cool. I like the color combo on here. Be strong and courageous. You like this one, too? Is this your favorite? Oh, thanks. Get it! Good girl! Oh, you... Oh, Cheyenne loves towels. Oh, is this going to be your new favorite toy? Oh my gosh, she loves it. Get it! Good girl! Oh my gosh, this is going to be... I think Cheyenne's going to steal that from me. Oh, there's a turtle bracelet in here. Look at that. I don't want you to chew on it. Though. No, don't chew on it. Okay, the Pokemon cards are Vulpix, Pikachu, and Pachirisu. Oh, these are adorable. I agree. These are amazing Pokemon. Aw, oh, thank you, Rebecca, for all the gifts. Which one's your favorite? <gasps> Which one Pikachu. was that? Pikachu. Good choice. This one's for you. Come here. You have to open this one. This one's for you. Here, this I'll... one says to Ed Roberts. I'll open it. Nope. You no. have to sit here. <laughs> no, no. Open it there. Give me the envelope. Open it there. Give me the envelope. This was a ploy, so you can open it on camera. Stop I will it. Open it on camera. Stop it. I'm in my underwear. 
I can't see that you're in your boxers. It's fine. Okay, fine. I'll open it, but I'll open it behind the camera. Fine, there. <laughs> open it. I'm sorry, you tried. It's not gonna work. I would love to see you on camera. No. Yeah, they do. Nobody wants to see me on camera. <laughs> they do. This is like, what in the world? It's a pen. It's a. You know what? This is some. This. this <laughs> oh my gosh! This is promotional mail. It's not even from a fan. It was to you, not me. This is a pen that says Snake Discovery, and the only thing inside is how you can order more pens for Snake Discovery. See? Nobody sends me so. And there's ice cube trays. Hooray! My promotional material! Doesn't even Sweet. say your name on it. Nope. Well, here's your pen. I want my pen, by the way. Give me my okay, pen. fine. You have your pen. Hooray! Ow. I was so excited. Somebody sent something to you. This is from Carter in Indiana. Whoa, there's lots of stuff in here. Oh, you, you take care of that. This is art. Whoa! He put his fingerprints on here. And... Ah, oh, stop Frenching me. And for fish! We have food for our fish! This is from Craig, who is actually one of our Patreon supporters. Okay, what's inside? Whoa! Snake, are these... Which is the most dangerous? Are these educational snake cards? Oh, they're like ID cards! Saw-scaled viper. Oh, that's what the African egg eater impersonates. Banded sea crate. Black mamba. Boa constrictors. Not just venomous. Oh, it's a game! How to play! This looks like if you have the most deadliest snake, yeah. you win the round. Whoa! That's cool. What else is in here? Oh, Gaboon Vipers. I love these. This is really neat. I did not know there was a snake card game. Don't, no, don't you want it? Oh, okay. Thanks. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what? Tell me what's wrong with this card. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Check this out, guys. This is the strangest Burmese python I have ever seen. It looks just <laughs> like a reticulated python. That is hilarious. That's totally a retic. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is funny. That's the coolest looking Burmese python I've ever seen. All right, so there's a letter in here. Oh my gosh. Jeez, oh peace. There's a lot of chocolate there. Hang on. From Craig, Wendy, Millie, Boston, Maddie, Colonel Cornflake, Reese's, and Sweetie. Thank Colonel you. Colonel Cornflake. There's so much chocolate here. We have nine and three quarters Hogwarts Express. Love Harry Potter. We have Cadbury Dark Milk and another Cadbury Dark Milk. These are going to be delicious. Eaten in about a day. A day, they'll be gone. No, you can't have chocolate, I'm sorry. Here, you can have hazelnut for my friend Gia. Here, you have this, I'll eat this. Mmm. Oh, I'll eat it right this here. This is good chocolate. You're gonna, oh. Thank you so much, Craig and family. Thank you for the card game and for the amazing chocolate. Bathroom break, again. Oh, the life of a YouTuber. Waiting for your bird to poop. This is the ball python that we had in like our second or our first male opening video. And we were fostering her at the time, but she is so friendly. She's just a big sweetheart that we decided to adopt her. And now she's part of our educational programs. So she is a permanent part of our family now. This is from Tara up in Canada. Yes, I really do need all of these reptiles. That's a really cute necklace. Why are you escaping? <gasps> she's wearing Cubone's mother's skull. <gasps> She's going to evolve. I'm a huge fan of your channel and I hope you like your gift. Tara, I love this necklace. This is really cute. This is from Caitlin in Kansas. It has a ring to it. There's a lot of tape. Where do I start? I have sent you two of my endangered wildlife shopping bags. I hope you will enjoy them and that you will continue your own work to educate people about our wild neighbors. Thanks again, Caitlin. This is the Hawksbill Sea Turtle. Oh, upside down. Wow, you hand drew this? This is really cool. Is that a cute little bag? I really like that. And then we have the Belanda Chameleon. Oh, this is a big one. Shop green, save wildlife. These are awesome! I'm gonna use these all the time! Thank you so much, Caitlin! Now, although Caitlin's, like, 
store info wasn't in the package at all, we looked her up. And if you're interested in bags like this too, because these are really cool, check out Penny Press Art on Etsy. We were able to find her on Etsy with these designs, and these are really neat. So I just wanted to mention where you can find them too. To Emily and Ed. Do you want to open this one? You should open this one. I'll tell you. I got my pen. My pen. <laughs> you got your pen. I don't know where it went. You lost your pen? Maybe. <laughs> Here we go. Jeez. <laughs> Opening away from myself. I hope you can now open your letters more easily. Uh-oh. <gasps> is this what I think it is? There's a box. Here we go. Here we go. What is in here? We all know it's in there. I think we do. <laughs> I think we know it's in here, but what does it look like? It's like a reptile. It'd be awesome. Oh, 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 it's a snake discovery oh, letter opener. That's cool. It's like Focus. shiny. It's so shiny. Now Emily won't cut herself. Yay! I can open everything with this. Who is this from? I didn't see a, a name on this. Whoever this is from, I want to thank you so much for this epic letter opener. Okay, this was going to be the last thing we opened today, but now we have to open something with this amazing letter opener. This is what we're gonna open with our new letter opener from Taylor, oh, I'm not gonna use the last name, from Taylor in Colorado. Check this out. Oh, that's so much easier. Still requires hand eye. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. And it even says snake discovery. Okay, this will be the last thing in this clip. I hope you like the little gifts, some fake branches for your baby snakes, and some little toy snakes. We have little baby branches. These are great for baby garter snakes. These will be perfect. Oh, we can put these in the little baby bins. This is kind of on our baby rack. That's like the perfect size for those bins. Oh my gosh, there's a lot in here. There's like a little baby garter snake. Yeah. And a cobra. And you're right. There's baby snakes to go with the baby plants. Garter snake and a cobra and little plants we can give to our own garter snakes. Thank you, Taylor. We will use these. All right, it's really late, so this is gonna be the last clip for today. Yes. Yes. We'll There's come back later. So Goodbye. Much. Ed broke into this one. You wanna explain yourself? We have a lot of packages around <laughs> and you're not opening them fast enough. I've been busy. <laughs> okay, what is in here? I oh, see first a package. Off, I can't not open it. <laughs> this is actually it doesn't say who it's from. American gift source. There's a thing inside. There is? Okay. See, how would you know if that was there? I That's... didn't open it beforehand. Okay, okay. <laughs> Good point. I love watching your YouTube videos, so I thought I would send you a little something to work on. Hmm. Oh, is this a puzzle? Ah! Oh, it's a parrot puzzle! Oh my gosh! That is really cool! It's like a shaped parrot puzzle, too. And how many? A thousand pieces? Yeah, it's gonna take a while. This is gonna be a great project. Do you see all the animals that are in this? There's Scarlet Macaws, uh, Keelbeald Toucan, Green Tree Python, there's a Day Gecko. There's all sorts of cool stuff in this. Thank you so much! I can't wait. Okay, next we have from Rebecca in Illinois. There's like two things in here. There. And you didn't break into this one. No, I left that one alone. We need the letter opener. Okay, we have something cylindrical. Martha's very interested in it. What is that? Thank you so much for your amazing educational videos on YouTube. My husband isn't really a reptile fan and my kiddos are obsessed slash in love. So your vid videos are truly a blessing. We all look forward to new uploads, especially around breeding, feeding, and hatching times. We hope you love your goodies from the Keaton family. Whoa! Cool. Oh my gosh! Wow, it's an insulated thermos. That is super cool. RK Vinyls and Designs. Oh, cool, this is Rebecca's graphic design business. Oh, you know what, I think I know what this uh, other piece is. Yep, it's a lid for it. <laughs> what? I love this. This this will be perfect for coffee on my way to every program that I go to. New favorite mug. If anyone else seeing this is interested in mugs, like this thermos here, you can actually visit RK Vinyls and Designs on Facebook. This came with, oh, look at this. Cheyenne! <laughs> Thank you so much, Rebecca and family, for the letter and the picture, which I will show to Cheyenne in the cutout. That's adorable. And of course, this thermos. This is really cool. Next, this is from Layla in Alabama. Oh, okay, shoot. Have I should have. letter next to you. And... I should have used this. I'll use it next time. <laughs> the snake. Oh, it is a snake. Oh, I see it now. I see its tongue. Ah. And an adorable picture of a hog nose. This is like. 
a keychain too, almost. I'll have to figure out a place to put this. Thank you, Layla. Oh, from Canada. Another opener. <laughs> oh, look at that. Look at, at that. how beautiful that was. Beautiful. It's a beaut. Ooh, a bracelet. Oh, I like the colors. I hope you like the bracelet I made you. Since I needed to attach each letter on the beads individually. Whoa, it, has, it does have letters on it. Oh, it says snake discovery. That is a really cool bracelet. I didn't even see the letters at first. My own snake discovery bracelet. Thank you, Amelia. From Nevada, from Alicia, I think is your name. Or Alicia. Sorry. No, weird. it's an A-L-Y-S-I-A. -A. Man, this is covered in tape. How am I gonna open this? She wants to screw with you. You're gonna start getting that. People can't trust you to open things. <laughs> I look over, you had the knife out. I'm like, okay, well. I got it open. You did. It's a glue snake. I think it's like hot glue that has oh, glitter nice. in it. Okay, hang on. Letter, letter. Emily gets distracted easily. Cool, thank you, Alicia. I'm gonna put you right here by ditto. Now we have this little package from, I can't even pronounce the country or the city it's from. Don't think there's a name, oh wait, on the other side. Nope, still not a name. Yeah. It's a turtle keychain, which is super cool. cute. Oh, it's little legs move. Uh, that's really shiny. It is very shiny, I love it. But I don't see a note in here. Well, I couldn't find a note in the package, but whoever you are, this turtle keychain is adorable and it's gonna go right on my keychain and it'll join me at programs so thank you very much whoa this is a pop-up card dear snake discovery i have i have a something i love alligators that's why my favorite is rex cool pop-up thank you alicia and talia this is really cute you're gonna go back here this one's taped with duct tape on the front that says open with a knife well you know what I'm gonna use my snazzy new letter opener. This is from Rishab. These letters are getting tougher and tougher to open. Yeah. This is, oh, there's a dollar bill in here. Aww. That was really nice of him. You know That's what? it? That's it. <laughs> I think he sent me something else too. I wanna say there's two from Rishab. We will find it. First off, thank you. And we will return to this when we find your other letter. This is from Keely. Open on camera, I can do that. There's a convenient hole in the back. It's There's right there. a hole right here that I'm going to use to open it with. Oh, this one jingles. Hopefully it's meant to jingle. I hope so. Okay, we've got two pieces in here. Oh, we have a matching set. A bracelet and a necklace. Ah, oh, sweet, a matching set. And I get a card, a handmade card. And I hope you like your gift. I know it's not chocolate, but I think you will like it. I love it, Keely. Chocolate. <laughs> she drew me and then cameraman ed is a question nice. mark you're such a mystery I know. sure enough you're behind the camera right now no video that i'm ever in <laughs> you can find him you're not in many though yeah i try not to be ha <laughs> <laughs> there's a pun here from ar an articulated python i said reticulated not articulated that's a really good drawing too is this original i think it is oh your channel has inspired me to become a zoologist the queen has returned. Uh -oh. Go. You just destroyed that plant. You can't land in that. You like broke off a branch. I have included a drawing of mine as well as a photo of Eddie, my best buddy and pet ball python. Eddie looks just like Martha. Thank you, Alan. I love puns and I love your drawing. What's in here? Let's see, letter opener. Oh, hi. Hello there. Rubber snake. I love jiggly toys like this. Rubber so snake doo -doo. Don't. You're gonna get that stuck in my head. Thank you, Leah, for the rubber snake. Let's see how Cheyenne likes it. Oh, I love the pictures you included too. I'll put these at the end. Postcard from Montana. Many well wishes from Missoula, Montana. From Kira. Man, that looks so pretty. It's all flatlands here in the Midwest. There's like cool mountains in Montana. Whoa, there's a dragon in this picture. These are like self-created dragons with even stats and like behaviors. Whoa, Bethany, you just put so many cool details into this. Please tell me your favorite drawing, then tell me your favorite dragon. I think my favorite dragon of yours is Crystal Wing. Let's see, you pick yours. I like the nearly headless snake. The nearly headless snake dragon. That one is wingless. 
And eyeless. Yeah. This is from Ava in Arizona. This is a picture of Robin Hood the ball python. Ah. And a picture of a grumpy hognose snake. That is a really grumpy hognose snake. <laughs> Don't read out loud. Oh, okay. Ah, it's because her number is in here. Whoa! Handmade turtle and snake. They survived UPS? Yeah, surprisingly, they didn't break in transit. That's a really impressive, actually. This is a false chameleon or an alligator. I'm not sure. Ooh, yeah. Is it an alligator or a false chameleon? They both have big, wide heads. Ava, let us know in the comments which one this one is. I'm guessing alligator. You guessing false chameleon? Sure. Okay. This one is fragile. It must be Italian. This is from Emma in Colorado. It took me off guard for a second because it's the same size box that we ship animals in. I was like. Uh oh, this isn't a live animal, is it? Don't it's, send us don't live, send animals. live animals. It takes us a while to open these. Got a scroll. Your breath smells. Ugh. Snake discovery danger noodle. Then inside, I'll try to open it so you can see too. A little handmade snake. That's adorable. Those are the eco friendly peanuts. You can technically eat those. I can eat these? Yeah. Put it on your tongue, it'll dissolve. You sure? Yeah. Tastes like corn. I think they are the edible ones, which is good because I just ate one. <laughs> just meant for you to put on your tongue. Oh, not to eat? <laughs> well, I ate it. <laughs> the things in the package are all handmade slash drawn by me from Emma. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that is cool. Handmade green tree python. White tree python. White tree python. <laughs> Be like blue eyed leucistic. Yeah. Green tree python. That is really neat. You put some. I just spilled the peanuts all over the floor. Thank you, Emma. <laughs> that was it, right? There wasn't anything else in there. No, that was okay. it. I sent bracelets, handmade. One for you and one for Ed. Which one do you want? These are from pink. Sage. You want pink? Yes. It's all yours. There you go. Sage, I love mine. Ed loves his too. <laughs> well, there's a lot of tape on this. I'm gonna need the knife. Every time you grab the knife, I worry just a little bit. <laughs> you worry for your life or mine? Either. Oh. Whoa, these are name tags. Oh, Alex, cool. These are name tags for Mr. Wilson, Brad, and Peanut. These are going on their bins for sure. So there may be a delay in the videos, but look for these in the future. I'm gonna put these on their bins. Elazar, this is a really cool drawing. It has all sorts of our animals on here. I see Cheyenne and Rex. Oh, and there's toy snakes in here too. Oh, these are cute. Oh, it's Vikings colors. I grew up in Minnesota, so. Ew. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's purple and yellow. It's Vikings. Ew. Here you go, Cheyenne. Thanks, Elazar. Whoa, whoa, things are falling out. Oh, an alligator sticker. Okay, I need to read the letter first. Whoa, there's even more snakes on here. We've got Rex, a hog nose, candy cane from Kaya. Kaya, thank you for all of these gifts. This is really nice of you. More owl stickers. Here you go. From Liam in Canada. Whoa, hog nose drawing. Cool. Cheyenne is so cute and I hope to see more of her on video. I would love it if in your next fan mail unboxing video you could show this art that I sent you to Cheyenne. Oh, I see the one that you mean now. You probably mean this, which is super cool. It's you. Look. Oh, don't I actually do it. <laughs> You like it? Is it good? What do you think? Dance if you like it. Go dancing. Aw, there's a dance. You like it, good girl. What is this? Okay, there is a letter. Hi, Emily and Ed. My name is Erica, and I just wanted to say I thought you could use this before Emily ends up losing a finger or two uh -oh. trying to get packages opened. Oh, man. What could this be? I think I know what's in there. But how do you open it? Oh, you know what? I'm gonna need this letter opener to open this box. Oh, could it be? It's a letter opener with snake discovery on it. Oh, this is cool. Yay, we have two. You are amazing. Thank you, Erica, for this letter opener. Now we've, now we've got two that we can choose from. I misplace things a lot. So honestly, this is Perfect, because then if I accidentally misplace one for a little bit, we'll have another one. Man, they're both so cool and unique in their own ways. What do you think? You like them both? Oh, that one I guess goes on the couch. <laughs> Thank you, Erica, for the letter opener. I love this. Two more packages for tonight. Oh, this is from Hunter in Oshkosh, which is Wisconsin. Is a bird uh, slash reptile's birthday the day the egg was laid or hatched? Technically, there's two for reptiles and birds. There's their lay day and their hatch day. 
I think most people go by the hatch but day. But generally, birds, the hatch day is birthday. I know with birds, they send you, or breeders will send a hatch certificate that says the hatch day is the day they were hatched. But you're right, yeah. lay date does play an important role. But you can easily figure that out by just going like 45 days or 55 days. or yeah. whatever. That's true. Cheyenne, what is that? Pull it out. Come on. Cool. I used to collect Beanie Babies as a kid. That's a Beanie Baby? Yeah, it's a Thai Beanie Baby. <laughs> Wow. I didn't know this was one of them. It's it's just called Snake. Well, this brings back memories, back from when I had like a whole collection of Beanie Babies. Now I have all the bears. There's a pin in here for Oshkosh Sadas days. Also in here is a Lego, I think of me. Is it? <laughs> There's a blonde oh. with a ponytail. Nice. And snake. a parrot and a snake. Nice, you gotta put them in their hands. Cheyenne likes it Cheyenne's too. Cheyenne's like, I wanna eat it. Parrot will have to go down. And a so red you snake. You can't have this Cheyenne. Yes! Lego version of me! That's really cool. Thank you, Hunter. Oh, it fits perfectly up there. That's awesome. Last package for today from Miss Natalie in California. Whoa! Nice. A hog nose and chocolate bunny. But, oh my gosh! It's a Lintz chocolate bunny. Oh, nice. Whoa! Whoa! I didn't even know they made these. That is totally a hog nose snake. It has the head stamp and everything. It's like a pink pastel. There we go. Uh, Conda. Oh, there's pictures in here too. She has a lavender. Lavender hog? Yeah, beautiful lavender hog. Our first little snake. Oh, wow, that's a really they went fancy. Expensive on their first yeah, snake. it's a fancy morph to have as your first one. Wow. I should actually. Hey, you should quiz me. Okay, what do you banana think? Banana ball python. Banana queen bee ball python. Oh, I actually wouldn't have gotten that. I would have just guessed banana, but I think I see the spider in there. Okay, how about this one? Snow hog. And? Snow and? Conda. Yes, snow conda. That is gorgeous. What is in here? Oh, oh my wow. gosh. Whoa, how can you write that small? I'm currently a PhD student studying wow. biochemistry. Wow. And you can imagine it can be quite stressful. Oh yeah. Just wanted to send you something as a thank you, which is a crocheted snow hog nose, my personal favorite morph. So turns out after reading this message, Natalie's snakes, including her ball python and hog nose, have their own Instagram account called Neon Noodle LV, if anybody would like to follow it. This is a hand crocheted hognose snake. That's really cool. Thank you so much for this, Natalie, and for the chocolate. Okay, I'm going to eat this, and we'll come back tomorrow for some, maybe not tomorrow, we'll come back another day to open up some more fan mail. One more package. Oh, oh my gosh, okay. Oh my it's a perfect throw on I guess we're, we're opening one more, but I want to eat this chocolate. Open the package first, then we can eat the Okay, punch it. Punch it open. If you use my black belt skills, I can palm this. Yeah, there you go. Oh yeah, what if it's fragile? We'll yeah. Go. I guess we won't punch it. Whoa, oh cool. Classic plans, there's a note. I'm gonna read the note. Hi Emily and Ed, I hope your snakes enjoy this from Elizabeth. Cool. These will be great for our snakes. Whoa! We could like stick these in our in all of our bins, really. The hogney, the hognays, the hognays snakes. The hognays snakes. Hognoses could use these. Thank you so much, Elizabeth. How many are in here? Aw, they're beautiful. And with that, I'm going to give these to our snakes. And I'm going to eat some lovely chocolate and some other treats that were in here. I'm going to enjoy. I'm going to put this on my keychain, and we're going to come back for more. All right, we're back again. This will probably be the last clip in today's uh, video, and I have Popeye, our albino labyrinth Burmese python, to help. This is from Tony in China. Cool. Huh. Okay. There's two things in here. Oh, three things in here. There's tweezers? Oh man, what is this? Let's see what we've got here. Uh, still not quite sure what this is. Oh, is this a craft? Oh Whoa! What? What? Okay. Got a bunch of little bitty tiles of different colors. Oh, I'm making this out of tiles? Yeah. What? That is cool! Board, but... Oh, you just put one color's worth, or one package into the green boat. I think, oh. I think I get it. So you take a package of these and you put it in the boat and then you use the tweezers and the pen here to pick up each piece and then place it on this. Oh my gosh, I can see the squares where they all go. <gasps> or do you, I think Look. you might take this off. Yeah, I think you do when you're ready. And then, well, okay. Yep. <gasps> oh my gosh. It's like the ultimate paint by number. Right, right? 
No, a little light bright or paint by number, depending on how. Jeez, you're old. Yeah. <laughs> light brights are awesome. Don't be, don't be dissing light brights. Pop yeah, by. I did. I loved light brights. That's gonna look epic. It's gonna take forever, but I'm gonna do it. Actually, I leave tomorrow for a two-week business trip out of town. So when I'm bored, I guess this is what I'll make. I don't need to edit this video when I'm out of town. I'll just make this. I don't see a note, but Tony, thank you so very much. Oh no, one of them, one of them's open. Oh, there's tiles on the couch. Tiniest little tiles. Okay. Are you open? Which one's open? Okay, I think I got all the loose ones and I discovered which was open and I taped it. We're good. Tony, this is really cool. I cannot wait to get, oh no, there's another tile. Maybe I'll post a picture on the community tab when it's done. I can't wait, thank you. We have a bunch of little pieces. Oh, cool. The first one I see is Rick holding a snake. Look at that. Are these stickers? Whoa, these are stickers. Naria, if I'm pronouncing your name right, you have some serious skill in drawing reptiles and Grandpa Rick. Man, check these out. We've got a chameleon, we've got a, f wow, that's a really cool frog. These are stickers? Oh yeah, look at that. Ah, oh, wow, handmade. <laughs> that's so cool. Rick stickers. But wait, there's more. Oh my gosh. What is, oh, it's a sea turtle. Oh my gosh, there's even more in there. Oh, <gasps> Pickle Rick. It's Pickle Rick, guys. We can stick him on the rack. Man, Naria, you drew a ton of these. Thank you for the handmade stickers, Naria. Man, there's so many. We can totally decorate like all of the racks with these. Whoa, Matthew sent us Pokemon cards. Oh, it's Cutie Fly. This is from Molly. Oh, it's a really cool drawing of Rex. And I think I see through the paper a drawing of Cheyenne. That's cute. Oh, and something else fell out of this too. Aha, cool. A letter opener. <laughs> nice. This is like a nice portable one. I could take it to go and actually open letters when I'm away from home. Thanks, Molly. This is from Dakota. Oh, these are cute little animal cards. Yeah. I feel like I'm going to the zoo just by looking at these cards. Thanks, Dakota. Okay, Popeye just kept trying to escape. So we're switching for Cheyenne. Come here, you can help. I know you're so excited. Oh, so that's right. So we had a letter from someone named Rashab, and I think it only, if I remember correctly, it only had a dollar bill in it. Well, we found three more from them that also have a duct tape seal that says open with knife. So it feels like there's like actually a letter in one of these. I'm really curious to see what he has to say. Okay, well, I'm sorry. I'm gonna open with a letter opener and not a knife. A birthday card? Aw, happy belated birthday, Rexy! <laughs> I love that you crossed it out and said alligator. That's awesome. I'm sure Rex will love her card. And then there's still two more from him. What is this? What is it? You're really excited too. What is this, Cheyenne? Is this a necklace? It is. It even has you on it, Cheyenne. You even did Taco, the soft shell turtle. Look at this. Got handmade charms. That is cool. Look, here's Taco. Oh, and Janet. Should we wear this? Oh, it's so pretty on you. Last one from Rashab. Finally, I found the letter from you. Okay, let's see what all of this says. It'll put it all together. Your snakes all look cool. <laughs> you guys should do a fashion show with all the snakes except for the babies and Nick. <laughs> That'd be awesome. I could wear this for the fashion show. Thank you for all of the envelopes and the little like pieces of the puzzle that I was able to put together. From Sony in California, we've got, whoa, a conure tail feather and stickers. I think, yeah, these are totally reptile stickers. Did you make these? I found your channel through Cheyenne because I was searching YouTube for some cute parrot content. I'd say you're a cute parrot. Yeah, you're a cute parrot. Enclosed is a picture of me and my one and a half year old Jende Conyer on his first day home. Oh, and this is one of his tail feathers. Cool, so Sony is an artist, graphic designer, video editor, bird groomer, and pet sitter. I love these stickers. They are definitely gonna go on our snake racks. Okay, we have a special plan for your Conyer's feather. Shane's so excited. Shane's very excited for it too. It's gonna go in our feather jar. Here we go right in front. Oh, that's a cool addition. Thank you, Sony. You know what's kind of weird? What? That'd be like keeping dead skin from humans. <laughs> but it's birds, so it's fine. Some people keep their kids' teeth. 
Or like their first lock of hair from a I haircut? Guess I still have my first teeth. You have your baby teeth yeah, still? Yeah, it's gross. Why? <laughs> They're in a little turtle dish. <laughs> Ow. All right, so we've got... Catch! Oh, oh my gosh! Catch! <laughs> Catch what the second the? one, Lise. Oh, what? Oh, gosh. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Shabby is so happy. <laughs> you never make those noises, Shabby. She's like, you guys are destroying things. Hooray! Uh -huh. These are from. If I, they're from the program today, right? Yeah, so these bags of Lynn's truffles are from a fan from a program in Cottage Grove, Minnesota at the library. I did not catch your name, but that was today that we met, and I want to thank you again for the Lynn's truffles. I was able to resist eating them on my way home only because I put them in with Doug's container. Otherwise, they'd be all gone right now. But, since I've got them now, I think this, I think the dark chocolate, the blue bags, I think that's my favorite flavor. You can't have chocolate. No, you can't. Not for you, all for me. It's like liquid chocolate. It was really warm today, which is why I had them with Doug, so I could bring them inside to my next program without kids seeing it. And I know you're chewing. That means you want some, but you can't have it. Thank you again for the chocolate from Abigail. He with the cutest little note that says, open me. I can use a letter opener for this. Here we go. Oh, did you see how easily that opened? Oh, it's a hand-drawn picture of Janet. When I heard Janet had passed, I knew I had to paint him for you. I hope you like it. Oh, I love this. Are you still going to do that thermostat comparison video? Yes, we are definitely still planning on doing the thermostat comparison video. We have a third one that we just got delivered that we are gonna add to the mix. And now that we have all three, we're gonna test them out. So that is coming up soon. That, that is really sweet. Oh, cool, your Instagram's on here. You guys can follow Al Abigail on Abby underscore paints from across the pond, but I can't tell who it's from. What just came out? Oh, it's a bracelet. Okay, we're good, we're good. Ah. Oh, it even says M on it. Oh man, there's more. Oh, I am called Erin and I live in England. Cool, we've got like a handmade rubber snake. This is gonna be indestructible for Cheyenne. You can't break it. Cool artwork. Thanks for the bracelet and for the snake in the picture, Erin. Oh, it has one too. Here, Erin sent you a bracelet. Oh, it's got a whale tail. Or a mustache. It's probably a mustache. <laughs> it's totally a mustache. <laughs> <laughs> a well, whale tail? Like a whale. I guess I can see. I can see where you you're coming from. Like that, okay, it okay. Like Thank you for the whale tail see? bracelet, Aaron. It looks like a I whale. I already showed it on there. Whale it's a mustache. It's a whale. <laughs> is this an alligator finger puppet? Oh, it is. <laughs> Dear Emily, my name is Jordan and I am nine years old. I hope you like the chocolate and puppet I've enclosed. I found the puppet. puppet. I love it. There's chocolate in here? That must be what's in this bag. Okay. Oh, they're nice big chocolates too. Look at that. Awesome. Thank you. This is a big piece of chocolate. I'm gonna save it for later. There's a card in here. A gift card for serves. I've never heard of serve. You guys don't have to give me a gift card. Okay, I'm gonna kind of fell out. So let's see what else is in here. Aww, I love the pictures. I can't, I'm not gonna show the picture of you, Caitlin, on here just cause it's the internet and everything, but that's a great picture of you. And I love this picture of the chameleon too. Thank you so much for the gift card. I actually have not heard of serves before. So I'm gonna have to look this up and see where I can go visit them. Hey babe, what is serves? C-E-R-V-S. A convenience store, okay. Thank you for the gift card, Caitlin. That was really nice of you. You don't have to do that. This one says, so you don't kill yourself. Here's an easy open package. Aw, from Dustin, we have a bracelet uh, made out of Candy Cane's colors. Aw, hopefully I find Candy Cane. I still haven't found her yet, but I still have hope. And this will be my additional hope. Thanks, Dustin. We have another one that says we care, but it is completely destroyed. Who's it from? Uh, from Ohio. I can't even see a name. That part's all destroyed. And it's like tie-dye now. Kind of cool. I mean, oh, this is from Lila. We have a picture of nearly headless Nick. Both of our portraits became tie-dye because they're kind of ruined in the mail, but I think that almost makes them look even cooler. This is from Horizon Elementary in Sun Prairie, Wisconsin. I think I might know what this is. Yes! It's pictures from every one of the kindergarten classes. I did programs for all the kindergartners earlier this year. 
Whoa, look at all of these. This is really cool. It was really nice of you to send these, Katie. Thank you. I hope Mr. Riggles is doing well. Please don't hurt yourself opening this package. You guys are starting to learn that I'm terrible at opening these. There's even circled lift here. This is how you do it, Emily. So you don't kill yourself, Emily. Okay. Oh no. Oh cool, these are stickers for like their caves or for the bins. Ellie, these are really cute. Oh, there's even one for you, Cheyenne, look. Can you read yours? Yeah, that one's yours. She has no idea, but they're really cute. Question from Ava, was Rex named Rex when you got her or did you name her Rex after you got her? Uh, we actually, her name was Rex and that was back when everyone thought she was a boy, but we decided to keep her name Rex because uh, apparently alligators can learn their names. Have you ever owned baby ostriches? I have not, but it's on my bucket list to ride an ostrich someday because they actually race them and I think it'd be epic to have said that I've ridden an ostrich. From Creature Care Cards, I think this is from my friend Siri. Oh, it is what I think it is. So, oh, that's really cool. These turned out great. So my friend Siri with Creature Care Cards makes these educational cards that are just business card size. And they, it's a full care sheet with, you know, kind of just the, uh, the bare bones of a care sheet because that's, you know, what you can fit on a business card. Wow, you did a really good job with these. It's crazy how much information you fit on the back of a card. That's awesome. Oh, there's even an axolotl one. Ball python info. That is cool. Okay, well, if anyone else is interested in one of these, you can go to creaturecarecards.com. Nice. This would be really good for, like, pet stores, just to have a bunch of these on hand for the species they sell. Man, I wish more stores did stuff like that. We got some cute little stickers from Sam. I'm going to have to figure out a good place to put these. So in this box from Emma, which should have been earlier in this video, I'm sorry who missed this earlier, but there is something else in the box. Clay inside. Tiny little letter. That is adorable. I made Nick out of clay for you. It is very easy to break, so don't feel bad if it does. I hope you enjoy. Oh, nice. That is really cute. Man, you made Nick. He even has divots instead of eyes. Aww. I can put him right there for now. Aw, he can watch. Thanks, Emma, for the little handmade Nick. That's really cute. I can't use a letter opener for this one. It's taped. Lillian, you're making this difficult. How do I open this? Thank you for helping me get over my fear of snakes. Now I have my own snake. P.S. What is your favorite chocolate? Just wondering. Probably these. <laughs> I really like those. Those or the uh, Ghirardelli squares, which, that's right, I have one here. Maybe I ate it already. Nice. Where'd you get your hands on like an adult female hognose? Those are actually pretty hard to find. There's Werther's in here. Ed really likes these. Thank you, Lillian. Okay, we have a package from Helen in California. This is a heavy package. Oh, Ed, there's one label just for you. I think you have to open it. I have one too. There's one for each of us. Oh, what are these gonna be? I do like the great ball with the Chansey on the inside. I choose you, Chansey. Oh, and there's also a little handmade tortoise or turtle, probably turtle, maybe? That's a flat shell, I'm gonna say turtle. I love all the details with the beads that you added to it. Come yes. here, come Look, here. I can see it Sit down right, right here. here, right here. Nope. It'll be like 10 seconds. Quit opening it. Stop it. They wanna see your reaction, that's no. why. Ugh. I'm gonna open mine on camera. Okay. We're opening them at the same time. A black mug? Yep. Oh, what's it say? I can't see it. The black mug. Do you think it's one of those thermal ones? Ooh, mine says something. Mine says snake mom. Cute. Aw, I really like this. Oh, it says on both sides too. Nice. Do you think yours is thermal changing? I think it is. Really? Yeah. Oh. Gonna boil water and we'll test that in a second. In the meantime, from Brady. Oh, over in Barron. That's really close to us. Whoa. Oh, Oh, that is cool. Oh, it's a milk snake. Thank you so much. This is a really nice painting of a milk snake. We're gonna put this back here and that is gonna show up in the background of our videos. That's really cool. I love the texture you gave to the background too. Thank you so much for that, Brady. This one uh, unfortunately ripped in the mail, but I still see a letter inside. Oh, it says, I made a cool bracelet for you that represents the colors of a green tree python. I hope you like it. Ah, but it was ripped open. Oh, Daphne, I'm so sorry. But your drawing of an adorable king cobra came through and I love it. Okay, we have one more package, but we're gonna test out this mug. Okay, is it, I'm watching the camera. 
I think I can kind of see. Oh, I think it is changing. <gasps> Yours says snake dad, and it's <laughs> cool. like thermal. It's changing. Whoa. That is really cool. Snake dad and snake mom. Helen, that was a really cool gift. Thank you for the mugs. Look, we're gonna be so styling when we have coffee mm -hmm. now. Get ready for Raxelton, an alligator musical. Okay, the last package is from Gillian, and it's covered in duct tape. I don't know how I'm going to open this. Ugh, so much duct tape. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is covered in duct tape. Help me, Cheyenne. Ugh. Have a beautiful Happy Mother's Day card. I'm a mother of snakes. You are? I understand that you must be confused receiving a Mother's Day card, although you are not a mother. <laughs> this card is for being the caretaker of over 50 animals and for all of your snakes who are mothers. Oh, there's still a couple of gifts in here. There's a little wooden box. It says treasure inside. My, my favorite. Whoa, there really is treasure in here. Oh my gosh. Oh, his favorite animals from the channel. Janet, Rex, Fatness, <laughs> and Cheyenne. It's you, this one's yours. Oh my gosh, I love miniatures. And these are adorable. Oh, oh, oh. We're rich, we're rich, Cheyenne. Did we get another scoopful. We're rich. <laughs> I think one fell in my ear. I have wanted a Mexican black king snake ever since I very first saw one and I saw and heard about the snakes in your Feed My Pet Friday where you showed off one eating a pinky. Mexican black king snakes are great little snakes. They're so pretty. Last package. Whoa. Oh no. Oh, the little tail fell off in transit. But oh, it's a Mexican black king snake, just like what you want. Okay, I can totally fix the tail. That is easy peasy. Oh, I had it upside down. That's still really cool. Jet black, just like the Mexican king snake is. Thank you for my little Mexican black king snake, Gillian. I really like this. So pretty. Okay, this diamond painting thing is really cool. So you just kind of take this. I've never done one before. So you pick up one of those. And then this is number two. Then I'm going to press it into place. There. Ta-da! Another one done. So I wonder if it actually shows how many tiles there are. This is 360. Oh, there's 1100 of these tiles of just that color. Oh my goodness. This is going to take a long time. I'll probably just do a little bit tonight because it's kind of late and I have a bunch of programs to do tomorrow. What is happening? I can't stop. This thing is so seriously addicting, but I'm loving every second of it. I will definitely post a picture when it's done on our YouTube community page. Thank you everybody for all of these amazing gifts, you are way too generous, guys. I mean, from gift cards to chocolate to clay figurines that you made and stickers that you made, thank you for it all. And thank you for all of the letters and the artwork. We, we do read every single letter that comes through, and I'm sorry I can't include each one in this video, but if there's artwork, I do try to at least include it a little bit towards the end. But before we wrap things up, I'd like to thank all of our Patreon backers for your support on this channel, and let me share with you some of the other artwork that we've received. 